Hello friends, good morning and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Chitra Varun and I am discussing previous year questions of biology. Friends, this is our day class in which we will discuss question number 171 to 200. So let's begin friends. These are my credentials. Question number 176. Which of the following is sweetest sugar? A. Sucrose, B. Glucose, C. Fructose, D. Maltose. So sugar, so uh, friends, हम बता दें, fructose is the sweetest sugar that is naturally occurring sugar, and this is 1.7 times sweeter than sucrose. So answer C is correct. Fructose is sweetest sugar. Question number 177. The H5N1 virus which caused bird flu was discovered in A 1991, B 1995, C 1997, D 2001. So friends, we will tell you H5N1 that is also known as bird flu and it is a type of influenza virus and it outbreak was first observed in Hong Kong in 1997 when 1 1.3 million of chicken were killed by the government of Hong Kong. So first case was observed in Hong Kong in 1997. Answer C is correct. Now question number 178. The science dealing with the study of teeth is odontology, ornithology, phenology, cosmology. So answer A is correct. Od odontology is the study of structure, development and abnorm abnormalities of teeth. Agar ornithology ki baat kare, then it is the study of birds. And phenology is the study of cyclic and seasonal climate relation to the, to the plant and animal. Uh, and cosmology is the study of universe. So answer A is correct. Odontology is the study of teeth. Now question number 179. The enzyme in which in whose presence glucose and fructose are converted into alcohol is diastase, maltase, invertase, zymase. So answer D is correct. Zymase is an enzyme that is obtained from the yeast and this catalyzes the breakdown of sugars like glucose and fructose and converted into alcohol and this reaction is known as fermentation. So answer zymase is correct. Question number 180. The study of visceral organ is angiology, arthrology, anthropology, D is planknology. So answer D is correct. Splanknology is the study of visceral organ like digestive system, urinary system, respiratory system and reproductive system. So splanklo ka matlab hota hai viscera. This planknology means the study of visceral organ. If we talk about the angiology, it is the study of disease of circulatory as well as lymphatic system that includes our veins, arteries. So it is the study of veins and arteries and lymphatic veins. If we talk about the arthrology, then it is the study of anatomy, function, dysfunction and treatment of joints. Arthro means it is related to the bone joints. Now last one is anthropology. Anthropology is the study of human behavior. So answer D is correct for visceral organ. Visceral organ is the study of it is the uh, splanchnology is the study of visceral organs. Question number 181. The branch of biology dealing with the study of cell is known as cytology, histology, phys psychology, physiology. So answer A is correct. Cytology means the study of cell in which in which the cytology uh, in which this is a branch of life cycle and in which it deals with the study of cell in terms of structure function and chemistry if we talk about the histology then this is the study of microscopic structure of tissues of our body and psychology that deals with the study of human mind and function now last one is physiology what does it mean? A branch of biology that deal with the normal function of living organism and their body parts. So cytology means hota hai. it is the study of cell. So answer A is correct. Question number 182. The study of extinct animals is called as herpetology or ornithology, geology, paleontology. 
सो आंसर डी इज करेक्ट पेलियंटोलॉजी इज द स्टडी ऑफ एक्सटेंट एनिमल इट इंक्लूड्स द स्टडी ऑफ फॉसिल्स टू डिटरमाइन ऑर्गेनिज्म इवोल्यूशन एंड इंट्रैक्शन विद ईच अदर एंड इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द हर्पेटोलॉजी देन इट इज द ब्रांच ऑफ जुआलॉजी विच डील्स विद द स्टडी ऑफ रेप्टाइल्स एंड एम्फीबियंस एंड और नीथोलॉजी इज द साइंस ऑफ बर्ड्स एंड जियोलॉजी इज द स्टडी ऑफ अर्थ सो आंसर डी इज करेक्ट एक्सटेंट एनिमल्स की स्टडी को बोलते हैं पेलेंटोलॉजी नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एटी थ्री द मेडिकल टर्म फॉर स्लीपलेसनेस इज सोमना एम्बुलिज्म इनसोमनिया हेलोजिनेशन निकटिन्यूरिया आंसर बी इज करेक्ट इनसोमनिया इज ए कंडीशन इन विच स्लीपलेसनेस अकर एंड इफ वी टॉक अबाउट सोमना एम्बुलिज्म देन इट इज द सिचुएशन इन विच मैन गेट्स अप एंड वॉक अराउंड वाइल इन ए स्लीप एंड इट इज यूजली अकर ड्यूरिंग नाइट टाइम एंड इफ वी टॉक अबाउट हेलोजिनेशन देन दिस इज द सेंसेशन दैट अपीयर्स रियल बट एक्चुअली दे आर नॉट रियल एंड दे आर क्रिएटेड बाय समवंस माइंड ओनली सो इन सेमनिया मीन्स स्लीपलेस लेस कंडीशन क्वेश्चन नंबर 184. एटी फोर द कॉजिटिव एजेंट ऑफ ट्यूबर क्लॉसिस इज माइको बैक्टीरियम एज पर जीलस रेपडो वायरस एच आई वी सो आंसर ए इज करेक्ट माइको बैक्टीरियम इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द ट्यूबर क्लॉसिस क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एटी फाइव द एंजाइम दैट इज प्रेजेंट इन द सलाइवा ऑफ मैन इज पैप्सिन रेनिन एमाइलेज ट्रिप्सिन सो आंसर सी इज करेक्ट एमाइलेज इज प्रेजेंट इन द ह्यूमन सलाइवा एंड दिस इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द ब्रेक डाउन ऑफ स्टार्च इन टू शुगर्स सो आंसर सी इज करेक्ट एमाइलेज इज प्रेजेंट इन सलाइवा क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एटी सिक्स ब्लड कैंसर इज अदरवाइज कॉल्ड एज एनीमिया पॉलीसाइथीमिया ल्यूकोपीनिया ल्यूकेमिया सो आंसर डी इज करेक्ट ल्यूकेमिया इज अ टाइप ऑफ कैंसर ऑफ ब्लड और बोन मैरो दैट इज कैरेक्टराइज बाय इन एबनॉर्मल इंक्रीज ऑफ वाइट ब्लड सेल्स सो इन ल्यूकेमिया में क्या होता है ये बोन मैरो और बोन बोन के अंदर उसमें ब्लड में होता है एंड इसमें डब्ल्यू बी सी काउंट इंक्रीज हो जाता है एंड इफ यू टॉक अबाउट एनीमिया देन इट इज इन दिस कंडीशन आर बी सी काउंट डिक्रीज हो जाता है इफ यू टॉक अबाउट पॉलीसाइथीमिया देन हेयर कंसनट्रेशन ऑफ हिमोग्लोबिन इंक्रीज बाई इंक्रीज इन आर बी सी कंटेंट If we talk about leukopenia, then there is reduction in the number of white blood cell. Leukopenia में white blood cell कम हो जाते हैं polycythemia RBC आर बी सी बढ़ जाते हैं एनीमिया में आर बी सी कम हो जाते हैं एंड ल्यूकेमिया में दिस इज ए कैंसर ऑफ बोन मैरो और ब्लड एंड हेयर द डब्ल्यू बी सी काउंट इंक्रीज सो आंसर डी इज करेक्ट ब्लड कैंसर इज नोन एज ल्यूकेमिया क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एटी सेवन रेडियो इम्यूनो एसे इज ए थेरेपी यूज टू क्योर lung cancer to cure aids to cure fracture in bone to detect antibodies and hormone present in in the blood sample so answer four is correct means d is correct it is used to detect antibodies and hormone present in the blood sample it is very sensitive technique and this is in vitro technique that is used to measure concentration of antibody by the use of antibodies A antigen antigen can be detected by use of antibodies for example hormone level in the blood can be determined by rea assay that is radio immuno assay so answer d is correct question number 188 which of the following is not a true snake glass snake sea snake tree snake blind snake so answer a is correct glass snake actually look like the snake but it actually is a it uh, in true sense it is a lizard so answer one is correct glass snake is not a true snake but it is a lizard now question number 189 which of the following set belongs to the class of mammalia a lion hippopotamus penguin bat b lion bat whale ostrich c hippopotamus penguin whale kangaroo d whale bat kangaroo hippopotamus so answer d is correct here whale bat kangaroo and hippopotamus belongs to the class mammalia they are mammals now question number 1190 which of the following pair belongs to cartilage cartilaginous fish so cartilaginous fish ka matlab hota hai uh, their skeleton is made up of cartilage not from bones so here shark and rays are two fishes 
uh, this is the pair of fish which skeleton is made up of cartilage so answer b is correct now question number 191 which of the following is not a true fish a silver fish b saw fish c hammer fish and d sucker fish so a answer a is correct silver fish is not a true fish and it is a wingless insect its scientific na name is lepisma saccharina so answer a is correct silver fish is not a true fish but it is a insect that is wingless now question number 192 john grigor mendel is famous for propounding theory of mutation law of hereditary cell theory theory of acquired character so answer b is correct law of heredity hereditary is uh, propounded by john grigor mendel and heredity is the passing on of trait from one parent to their offspring so law of hereditary is discovered by john grigor mendel question number 193 which of the following has no skeleton at all so on uh, a is starfish b is sponges c is jellyfish and d is silverfish so answer c is correct jellyfish their body is almost totally made up of water and it is a soft having no bone no bones at all and they are invertebrates and they do not have ears eyes nose even they don't have brain or heart so answer c is correct jellyfish doesn't have bones question number 194 which of the following weeds has been found useful to check water pollution caused by industrial affluents one is parthenium b is elephant grass c is water hyacinth d both a and b so friends uh, water hyacinth is correct answer water hyacinth ka kya kaam hota hai this is used to treat waste water from dairies tanneries sugar factories pulp and paper industries as well as they can remove the uh, pollution from the palm oil mills as well as distilleries so answer c is correct water hyacinth jise hum ecornia bhi bolte hain that is correct answer question number 195 which of the following is correlated with the blood pressure a liver b testis c pancreas d adrenal so friends iska answer hai adrenal adrenaline gland jo hoti hai that is responsible for the blood pressure blood pressure indicates the health and function of adrenal gland so answer d is correct now question number 196 which of the following structure present in mammalian skin skin directly helps in keeping the body warm one a is pigmented cell b is sweat, sweat gland and c is lymph vessels and b d is blood capillaries so answer c is correct lymph vessel is present in our human body and that is a structure that helps uh, in keeping the body warm to lymphatic lymphatic vessels jo hota hai consist of a network of specialized lymphatic vessels and various tissues and organ throughout the body and that contain white blood cells jo ye white blood cells hoti hai that is present in the lymphatic vessels or lymph vessels and that helps the body to fight infection and disease so answer c is correct lymph vessels are present in the body that helps in uh, keeping the body warm now question number 197 which of the following disease usually spread through milk a tuberculosis b jaundice c diphtheria d cholera so friends tuberculosis ek to human being mein hota hai that is caused by tuberculosis mycobacterium tuberculosis and uh, this is spread by air and this is uh, uh, present in our lungs the bacteria that infect our lungs and dusra ek hota hai that is bovine tuberculosis it is very similar disease that affects the cattles as well as deer goats and uh, many other animal and this is infection is caused by a bacterium mycobacterium bovis se hota hai ye and this human infection uh, this is uh, transmitted through the milk ye hota hai milk se transmit hota hai one uh, animal se dusre animal mein agar human ki baat kare then human mein tuberculosis mycobacterium tuberculosis is transferred uh, इन्फेक्टेड फ्रॉम दी एयर एयर से इन्फेक्शन आता है ह्यूमन बॉडी में और वो लंग्स में होती है सो आंसर ए इज करेक्ट ट्यूबर क्लॉसिस जो होता है माइकोबैक्टीरियम बोविस से होता है दैट इज स्प्रेड बाई दी 
मिल्क और वो कैटल्स में होता है क्वेश्चन नंबर 198 विच ऑफ द लार्जेस्ट फिक्सेटर ऑफ सोलर एनर्जी बैक्टीरिया प्रोटोजोआ फंजाई ग्रीन प्लांट सो आंसर डी इज करेक्ट ग्रीन प्लांट इज द लार्जेस्ट फिक्सेटर ऑफ सोलर एनर्जी क्वेश्चन नंबर 199 नाइनटी विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज ए करेक्ट डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ टिश्यू कल्चर इट इज ए कंजर्वेशन ऑफ फॉरेस्ट एंड प्लांटेशन बी ग्रोथ एंड प्रोपोगेशन ऑफ हॉर्टिकल्चर क्रॉप्स सी साइंस ऑफ कल्टिवेटिंग एनिमल टिश्यूज इन आर्टिफिशियल मीडियम डी प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ वाइल्ड एनिमल सो आंसर सी इज करेक्ट टिश्यू कल्चर इज द ग्रोथ ऑफ टिश्यू और सेल दैट इज डन सेपरेट फ्रॉम द ऑर्गेनिज्म इट इज नॉट डन इन साइड द ऑर्गेनिज्म एंड दिस इज दिस इज डन बाई यूजिंग लिक्विड सेमी सॉलिड और सॉलिड ग्रोथ मीडियम सच एज ब्रॉथ और अगार में होती है इनकी ग्रोथ टिश्यू कल्चर्स में एंड सो दिस इज द साइंस ऑफ कल्टिवेटिंग एनिमल टिश्यूज इन आर्टिफिशियल मीडियम अलग से होती है ग्रोथ दैट इज नॉट इन साइड द्यूम नॉट इन साइड द ऑर्गेनिज्म इट इज सेपरेटली होती है इनकी ग्रोथ और ग्रोथ मीडियम यूज किया जाता है लाइक like अगार और ब्रोथ यूज किया जाता है उसके अंदर हम कोई भी प्लांट का टिश्यू उसमें डाल देते हैं एंड दे ग्रो प्रॉपर सनलाइट प्रॉपर टेम्परेचर देकर हम उसे ग्रो करते हैं दैट इज दैट इज नोन एज टिश्यू कल्चर सो आंसर सी इज करेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 200 हंड्रेड विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग मेक्स द स्किन लेयर इम्पर्वियस टू वाटर कोलाजन मिलानिन किराटिन काइटिन सो आंसर सी इज करेक्ट किराटिन इज ए फाइब्रस प्रोटीन दैट मेक्स अवर outer uh, layer of skin and it is also component of hair and nails and keratin is very tough and insoluble to water so answer c is correct keratin is um, impervious to water now friends we are stopping our video here and we will discuss question number 201 to 225 in our next video so stay tuned with my channel for the latest update of videos so thank you friends